Hey Vintage Dolls, it's Emmeline. So today I am finally doing a vintage hair and makeup look. So this video is actually a collab with two amazing ladies, Alex and Katie, and I will have their Instagrams right here. And I'll also have their links in the description box that way you guys can follow them. And make sure you guys follow them on Instagram because they were so sweet to do this video with me. And they are just so amazing and so talented. And they've worked on some incredible people Alex has even done Adriana Lima's makeup. I totally fangirled because I love Adriana Lima. So today we all decided to work together to make this vintage soft glam look. And we definitely forgot to film the intro together. We just got too excited. But if you guys want to learn how I got this look, then just keep watching. So Alex is starting off by prepping my face with this moisturizer. And Kate is going in my hair and prepping it with this coconut oil spray. It smelled so good. So she parted my hair in a deep part and now she's sectioning off my hair. She's leaving down some of my hair because she wants to keep the length and the curls. The rest she's gonna pin up after she curls each piece. You guys will see shortly. Now Kate is going in with the Hot Tools Curler and she is curling the pieces towards my face and this is what's going to help to give my hair a very vintage -y look. So now Alex is going in with the Modern Renaissance Palette and using the color Tempera to go all over my lid and in the corner of my eyes. Now she's taking Antique Bronze on a fluffy brush to blend this into my crease to give my eyes a little bit more depth. Now she's going in with Cypress Umber and she's putting this in the outer corners of my eyes and this will help my eyes to pop a lot more and she's just blending this out. Now she's just taking a cotton pad to kind of just get all of the extra fallout off of my face and now she's taking a flat brush and going back in with Tempera to make my eyes pop. As you guys can see that really made such a huge difference. And now she's going in with the Ardell Wispies and she is just trimming them to fit my eye shape and we were laughing because her scissors were so adorable. So I have a really hard time with people doing stuff to my eyes and putting on fake eyelashes so she was prepping me through this and telling me what to look at so that I didn't freak out and glue my eyes together but this was actually, it went so smoothly and so well so thank you so much Alex for making this go very well for me. So now she's going in with the Becca liner in a nude color and she is just lining my lower lashes and or my waterline and this is going to help my eyes to appear bigger as you guys can see. I really freak out when people do stuff to my eyes. I could not stop blinking. So now she's going back in with the Cypher Umber and just going under my lash line. Now she's going in with the IT Cosmetics CC Cream and this stuff was amazing. It didn't even feel like I had makeup on. It was so light and so dewy on my skin. I love this so much and the coverage was absolutely amazing. So here Kate is still just going in curling my hair and now Alex is taking the NARS Creamy Concealer and going under my eyes, the bridge of my nose and on my chin to highlight and conceal my face. So now she's taking the Kat Von D contour palette and she is just contouring my face but she is just putting it where the sun would naturally hit my skin. So she is putting it on my cheekbones and on the sides of my nose and we didn't want to go too crazy with this, we wanted to look natural. Now she's going in with the Smashbox Brow Tech to Go and she is just lightly going over my brows. I really like this because it wasn't too heavy on my brows because I feel like if my brows look too dark and then I look like a completely different person. So this product was amazing and then on the other side there's a brush to help set them. So as you guys can see, Kate is just taking the pieces that she curled, wrapping them around her finger and then placing them in with a pin and this is going to help to set the curls. And now Alex is just taking um, some eyeliner and just going over my lash line. Just a very, very light line, nothing too crazy. And Kate is now going back in with some hairspray to help set the curls. Now Alex is curling my fake lashes. I have actually never curled fake lashes before. This was a game changer. They felt like they were out of my eyes. I didn't feel like they were like the butterflies on my eyes. It was so amazing. And now she's going in with the Laura Mercier powder just to set my makeup.
So Alex actually has a makeup line which is called Moi by Alexandria and it is amazing. This is in the shade Cleopatra and she is going over this to highlight my face and as you guys can see the little um, the little brush for this, I don't know what to call it right now, the little poof, there we go. <laughs> the little poof for this is so adorable, it looks very vintagey and I was obsessed with it, it's such a gorgeous color. And here Kate is just teasing my hair and brushing out the curls a little bit. Now she is going back in with another one of her products. This is her lip gloss in the color Embrace. And this is like the perfect shade. I've been so obsessed with this. I've been using this nonstop. It feels amazing on my lips. It smells like a cupcake. It is so, so good. So if you guys want to test out her products, I will have the link to her website down below. I definitely recommend you guys try it out because it is so amazing. So now she's going in with the Dior mascara to coat my lower lashes and to blend my real lashes with the fake lashes. So here Kate is just going back in, once again, teasing the hair and just brushing some of it out. So now she's just taking a normal hairbrush to lightly brush through the curls and this is going to help to give it that really soft Hollywood glam look. I love this hair. It came out so well. Kate did such an amazing job. And I also wanted to mention that Alex made a blog post on our girls day. We had so much fun. Her house is so adorable. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys probably saw her pink steps. Her house is like a pink dreamland. It is amazing. We had tea and such a fun girly day. So definitely check out her blog. And so now she's just placing the pieces of hair where she wants them to stay and then she is spraying them. That way it kind of shapes to my face. It's kind of hard to explain if you guys can see it. And so this was the big reveal. I didn't see my makeup until the end. And I was blown away because I am so picky when it comes to makeup, but they did such an amazing job on both my makeup and hair. I absolutely loved it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then be sure to give it a thumbs up and also be sure to follow them. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're all having a lovely day. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.